It doesn't matter how old you are. There is a little child within you who needs love, attention, and acceptance. If you are a woman, no matter how self-reliant you are, you have a little girl who's very tender and needs your affection. If you are a man, no matter how strong you are, you still have a little boy inside you who craves warmth and affection. As children, when something went wrong, we tended to believe that there was something wrong with us. Over time, the child believes, I'm not lovable, I'm not worthy, I'm not good enough. As we grow older, we carry these false beliefs with us. We learn to reject ourselves. There is a parental figure inside each of us as well. Often, this parent admonishes the child. When we listen to our inner dialogue, we can hear the scolding. We can hear the parent judge our daily decisions, actions, and behaviors. We need to allow our inner parent to become much more nurturing. Become the kind of parent you always wanted. Learn how to praise and honor yourself. I have found that working with the inner child is most valuable in helping to heal the hurts of the past. At this point in our lives, right now, we need to begin to make ourselves whole and accept every part of who we are. We need to communicate with our inner child and let them know that we accept the part that did all the stupid things, the part that was funny looking, the part that was scared, the part that was very foolish and silly, every single part of ourselves. Love is the greatest healing power I know. Love can heal even the deepest and most painful memories because love brings the light of understanding to the dark corners of our mind. No matter how painful our early childhood was, loving our inner child now will help us to heal it. In the privacy of our own minds, we can make new choices and think new thoughts. The universe, higher intelligence, source energy, or whatever higher power we choose to believe in will support us in our efforts. Let's together share a meditation to integrate our inner child and upgrade the loving parent within. See your inner child in any way you can. Notice how they look and feel. Comfort your child. Apologize to them. Tell them how sorry you are for forsaking them. You have been away for so long and you are now willing to make it up to them. Promise this child that you will never leave them again. Anytime they want you or need you, you will be there for them. You will listen and you will be there no matter what is going on. If they are scared, you will hold them. 
If they are angry, it is okay for them to express their anger and hurt. Tell them you love them very much. You have the power to create the kind of world you want your child to live in. You have the power of mind, the power of thoughts, and the power of your words. See yourself creating a wonderful world. This is a world that your child can live in harmoniously. See your child relaxed and safe. See them peaceful, laughing and happy. See them playing with friends, running free, admiring a beautiful flower or hugging a tree. See your child playing with a gentle puppy or kitten. See them playing on the playground, laughing with joy. And now they run up to you with a bright smiling face to give you a big hug. See the two of you healthy and living in a safe place. You and your child shine. You are greeted with joy wherever you go. You create a special kind of life. See where you want to live and what you want to do every day. See yourself surrounded with supportive, generous, creative, and loving spirits. Most important, see yourself whole, happy, very healthy, joyous, and free. And so it is. Affirmations are inspirational, positive statements that you say or think about yourself. Saying daily affirmations help us program our negative self-talk so we can manifest more positive thinking, feeling, and experiences in our lives. Today, I focus on inner child healing. I am perfect, whole, and complete, just as I am. It is healthy for me to reparent myself. I am worthy of love. I am protected now. It is safe for me to laugh and play. My self-worth is greater than I can ever imagine. I am worthy of all of the love that life has to offer. I deserve to be treated with respect. I honor and cherish my younger self. I outwardly express love for my inner child. It is safe for me to express joy. The child in me is free. I love my younger self. I forgive my younger self. It is safe for me to cry. The 
The pain I experienced in childhood is real. I am sheltered now. My inner child's voice deserves to be heard. Every day, I embrace who I am more and more. My inner child is happy and at peace. I release all pain I have been carrying for years. It is safe for me to seek professional help. I frequently check on my inner child. I am healing more and more every day. I will confidently overcome any obstacles sent my way. It is safe for me to put myself first. I deserve to set boundaries with my parents. I honor, respect, and love my inner child. The people who love me will stay. I attract people into my life who are good for my soul. Today, I let go of all feelings of shame. I give myself grace and time to heal my inner child. I am the hero in my own story. I am the one who saves myself. I listen to my inner child's voice with conviction. Every day, I choose to reparent myself. I am stronger than I give myself credit for. My voice is sturdy and confident. My hope has been restored. I release all feelings of burden I've held on to for years. I am worthy of an impeccable life. My inner child is thriving. I choose myself each and every single day. It is safe for me to express both happy and sad emotions. All my past experiences have led me to this moment. I am in a healing space. The intense hurt I feel is true and valid. Expressing vulnerability is my strength. Today, I hold my inner child's hand with tenderness and love. I communicate with my inner child daily. I fully accept myself in this current state. It is safe for me to ask for support. Sharing my story helps heal myself and others. Every day, I connect with my inner child. It is safe to let my playfulness shine. I forgive myself for all my past mistakes. I choose to stop going down the path of self-hatred and self-destruction. With every breath, 
I honor who I am. I accept myself unconditionally. My life is a place of happiness and love. I am lovable. I cherish the unique person I am. I easily set boundaries in all areas of my life. I respect myself and treat myself with kindness and love. When others speak negatively of who I am, I let the negatives roll easily off my back. I choose not to take it personally. I choose to stop apologizing for who I am. The only approval I will ever need is my own. I honor my inner voice. I have valuable things to say. Others value me and my opinions. Love is my birthright. I'm meant to be here. I am in charge of my emotions, desires, and abilities. My inner child is healing from the inside out. I give myself permission to make myself a priority. I am allowed to express pain. Today, I choose to be patient with myself. My childhood trauma is releasing with every breath. I am unstoppable. My inner child looks up to the person I am today. I am carefree. I trust myself. It is safe for me to trust others. I can rely on myself. My inner child guides me throughout my life. The past is the past for a reason. I live in the here and now. I feel blessed to be who I am today and every day. I believe these affirmations are making a massive difference in my life. I fully trust and honor what my inner child is telling me. All my inner child wounds are healed. My mind is free of resistance. The changes I am making in my life will set my spirit free. I release all thoughts of not being good enough. I am whole and complete. This is Sam. Know that I love you. <laughs>